Hey, it's Greg, and I'm with Epi and Bonnie here on Adventure Island. And we've come to this amazing tree right behind me because Epi spotted something. Can you see? Here on the tree, there's a secret letter waiting for us. And it's the letter P. P. That's right, the letter P. And Epi and Bonnie think that this letter belongs to a brand new character that we haven't met before here on the island. And Epi's telling me that there's a gift for us waiting here at the tree if we know our doubles. Is that right, Epi? Yeah, Bonnie, are you sure? Yeah, okay. Well, apparently we've got to know what certain numbers are when they are doubled. So hopefully at home you can help us with this because Epi wasn't so sure. But look, ready? If I want to know what double one is, I put one upon this finger. Oh, Epi's in the way. One, and now double one, put another one up. How many have I got all together? That's right, two. Double one is two. Oh, we've got that one, Bonnie. Double one is two. Let's try this one. I wonder what double two is. Two on this finger, on this hand, sorry, and two on this hand. They're double. Ready? What's double two? One, two, three, four. Yeah, double two is four. Is that right, Epi? Are we okay with that? Yeah. Oh, she's coming and sniffing along. Yeah, look, Epi, double two is four. Yeah. What about this one? This is super hard. What about double three? Three on one side, so we must have three on the other. What is double three? One, two, three, four, five, six. Double three is equal to six. What's that, Epi? There's one. Oh, apparently there's one more. We've got to know what double five is. <gasps> so double five. Five on one hand. And then five on the other. What is double five? That's right, it's ten. Double five is ten. And it will always be equal to ten, double five. Look, five, five, ten. Double five is equal to ten. What's that, Bonnie? You think something's appeared at the bottom of the tree? Ah, right, let's go and have a look then. Come on, Epi, let's go and see. Come on, let's have a look. Oh, my goodness, you were right. Look, Epi. Yes, Bonnie. Come on, let's go and show them. We've got it, look, we found something. Yes, thanks for all your help. This looks really cool, doesn't it? I wonder. Look, it's a little mini message centre. I wonder what's inside it, shall we see? Oh, look, there's a message and I think I can see some writing in there. Let's open it up. Hey, Epi and Bonnie, check this out. Look, look at this. No, Epi's come to read it. Can you see Epi? Bonnie, can you see it? Yeah, I know. Bonnie just read it. I wonder whether you can help us read it at home. Ready? It's a message just for us. Come to the party. Come to the party. And look, there's that secret symbol from last week, the exclamation mark. But also, oh, that secret letter. It's from whatever character it is whose name begins with P. Come to the party. So someone's having a party, Bonnie. I wonder who it can be. What's that, Epi? What? You're kidding me. The Poggle? Huh? Have you ever heard of a Poggle? I haven't. What's that, Epi? It's this way. Right, okay. Apparently, the Poggle lives over this way. We're gonna go and follow, our, um, follow Epi. I think Epi's already gone to go and have a look. We're, I'm gonna go and follow Epi. Come on, Bonnie, let's go. Let's go and find the Poggle. Ready, let's go. Meet the Poggle. Here he is. He lives under the ground. He's really friendly. And one thing that you might not know about the Poggle is that he can run Super, super, super fast. There's only one Poggle. And just like the Bog Babies, he scurries and tunnels under the ground. But unlike the Bog Babies, he can go really quickly. I mean, supersonic. And there is the Poggle's secret letter. P Hey, I've got a great idea. Why don't you go and write the secret letter for the Poggle and go and hide it in your window somewhere so that the Poggle knows that he can come to say hello. 
the Poggle might actually need a secret number too, but Bonnie and Eppy have no idea what it could be. Do you? <laughs>